Hey guys, it's Cassie and today we have an airport shopping vlog. I am on my way to Ghana. If you didn't know, I am quarter Ghanaian and I may have chosen a flight that has a little stopover, a little layover at Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris. Why you ask? Because they have all of our favourite luxury designer brands and um, you get 13% off VAT. Hello. Hello, why not? Guys, if you are new here, my name is Cassie. I am a self-diagnosed luxury addict. I put out videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So if you like luxury fashion, then you're probably gonna love it here. So head down there, subscribe, turn on the bell, become a member of our luxury addicted family. When are we going to rehab? <laughs> Never. Okay, guys, are you ready? Let's go to Paris. They are giving me very like chunky Chelsea boot situation, but with like a tiny little bit of monogram trimming. I want you to see. Very nice, very classic. We love her. The coussin bag. Mm, not entirely sure about that colour. These are the Bella bags, and I really, really like the softness of the leather of these. It's like a really fabulous, very kind of feminine bucket bag but the black one's a little bit more edgy this one's a little bit it reminds me a little bit of skin actually so maybe not but i love how it's like perforated do we see the light shining through love that for her it's really cute very cute size it's a little bit more classic arch lights the vanity cases these are the boots up close. I really like these. I think these are great. How much are they going for? Price at the airport, 970. Usual price, 11,000. Airport price, 970. Okay, this is exciting. Well, this isn't. This, this word art monstrosity. Absolutely not. How dare you? How dare you? And what is this? No, I don't even want to know. No, it's going to make me too sad. 1,330 1, duty free. No, thank you. However, this, I love it. It's a cashmere. You've got a travel cape. Oh, I die. It's got like a little zip halfway through. You've got monogram details on the joggers. Stop, stop. How much are the joggers? Tell me the price. What? Oh, 1, 1,590 tax free. It's usually 1,800 euros. Oh, stop, those are immaculate. I'm dead over this entire set. Fabulous. I like cashmere throws and they've got quite a nice little range of ready to wear, to be honest. Satin bonnet jacket. I just walked into a table pretending like nobody saw. Shoes wise, what are we dealing with? We have the puffer boot, um, not very popular autumn winter. They've got quite a lot of classic shoe shoe options here. Now nothing kind of too new and trendy, but the ones that people might want to go for. You've got the runaway sneakers down there. You also have these in like a pink. She's got something happening there. That's fun. Look at this though. I like this one with like the strap across the top. Vibes. These are very cool, okay? And I really, really think that they could be given a chance for an autumn winter moment. Just casual jeans, top it off with these, my gosh. I just love that chunky white sole there. It's a canvas, a little monogram moment at the back there. Did it need to have that? Not necessarily, but also, you know, it's not going against it too much. And you have some sandals here, some very sort of, no offense if this is your style, but that's incredibly boring brown leather shoes and a mule version. Uh, you know, each to their own, you know? Oh my gosh, look at this range of hair clips. We've got like a barrette thing. A little, okay, those are rings. These are tiny little hair, hair claws. They're just so adorable and cute. 220 little long ones. We've got some more fashion jewelry, some more barrette things. They're very cute. I'm usually not very good with like hair stuff because I'm always a bit worried that it's going to fall out. Okay, these are very cool earrings. Okay, it's like 
Ooh, I love that it's half silver, half gold. This is a great everyday moment. We have that iconic Louis Vuitton monogram icon flower, whatever the hell it is here. <laughs> Sticking out at the front. It looks a bit aggressive, actually, front on. It might look a little bit aggressive, a little bit medieval. And then you've got gold, silver at the front, gold at the back. These ones. How much are they? Okay, these are all ranging tax-free between 275 euros and 380. I think these are 380, these are 275. Let's go over to the men's. Hello. Because uh, they they know what they're doing, let's not lie. Look at this. Damier print, just like sodden, cozy, fabulous sweater. Love that. What's happening here? Okay. A little bit of a cut and paste mag magazine moment. You know, we can't have them all. We can't have them all. Men's shoes. These are very cool. Men's sunglasses. Always seem to have it going on. Look at those. A little bit different to the millionaires, but not too dissimilar. Oh, aviator, black and gold moment. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. What a fabulous size. Could still get, you know, a little bottle of water mm -hmm. or something. Mmm. Nice yeah. Really nice. Yeah, that's so nice. Fantastic. Okay. Amazing neon trimmed keyboard there with the canvas strap. This one is 1,560 euros tax-free. Aha, uh -huh, okay, yeah. yeah. This is a bit boring for me. However, I will say the quality is fantastic. This also comes in a very large size. Um, these are really, really cute makeup bags. I think that everybody, you know, there's always Louis Vuitton, but what about Celine? You know, just a little makeup pouch, cute, does the job, looks cute while doing so, a little bit different. Ah. Oh, wow, yeah. Oh my gosh. This is just so cute. I tried it on like a, like a month or two ago in the lilac, but didn't like put it on. And in... The shoulder bag, I just think it's so like cute and perfect and Y2K, but the good Y2K and not like the stuff that's giving us PTSD, you know, low rise jeans. But okay, so this is the tan, they also have it in the black and the Triumph print. Here we have the loo. Oh, and they even have the shoes. Fabulous, though crippling, but fabulous still. These are some like fabulous drop earrings. Really cute. I actually really like this one in the like very natural canvas with the brown, and this is wood. I love that, it's kind of giving me a very, very spring summer. It's like, instead of a raffia bag that everybody has, this is just something a little bit different, you know? So I like that a lot. They have a really good range actually of very, of all of like the neutral colors and the classic styles. Well, let's have a go at the old gooch. What have they got for us? I love these travel cases. Honestly, we never think of Gucci when it comes to, you know, travel cases or whatever. Oh, they're so cute and very chic and fabulous. You know, I love this line. Stop, did not realize they had a duffel bag in this debossed leather. That's really nice. You know, I'm not really a fool person, but if I was, that would be a good one. These are more like wintery scarves. Still nice though in that kind of sparkly white. Super cute, great 
scarf, matching gloves. Also available in white with beading. Though, you know, I'm not sure how much of a beating that can take. I love these, it's so Carl. It's so everything. Okay, saw these in another vlog. But let's see the price difference, here. Yeah. 1380 with the tax free. I just really like that. They are thick, three fifties, and she means business. And we like that about our boots, don't we? Yes, we do. It's honestly some of the best select belt selections I've ever seen from Chanel. They're usually like, I don't know, there's usually like two, and then it's like, well, there's your choice, but they've got loads. Cruella watch. Just like, why? Why not? You know? Very interesting. Haven't seen this one. She gives me classic, but she gives me a little something else. I really like the leather actually. It's quite smushy. And like a little bit casual, which I quite like. The tiny, tiny babies. Like, this is even tinier than I thought. Look at that tiny little turn. Look, I'm gonna cry. This is the first time I've seen these in person. And they are truly a sight to behold. Look at that. Look at that little patent boy bag. And the ri Oh, stop. This is... I'm going to cry. Honestly. Stop. Anybody got 25,000 euros for me to purchase this just simply for my own pleasure? Thank you. Got the loafers. Again, super popular. Again, how much are these going for? Let's see. A uh, 1,000 euros. About that. Oh my gosh, I was going to say this is a cutie, but it's also a mess. My gosh, it's a lot. I like, I, I, I like this dangly thing, I like the chain, but then what's happening here is it's a lot for the eyes there. My gosh, it's quite nice with the leather actually. They're very light. Yes, these are like runners. Yeah, know how I feel about these. Ooh, I don't know how I feel about these. It's something about the very stark white against the black that's giving me penny eyes. <laughs> You know, is he going to crawl out of the sewer and grab my ankles? Possibly. So in all black, you know, it's, it's a different situation. But in the white and the black, that's, that's what it makes me feel. Hermes shoes. These are knitted, actually, like knitted runners. Their version of the Balenciaga sock trainers. But, you know, decidedly more elegant, I believe. <laughs> Um, they've not got a crazy colour selection of Iran's, actually. They've got the metallics. These are both very nice, actually. Look at those because like that, that gold isn't too gold it's more on the bronze side and then you've also got this one again which is that kind of softer i think it's goat skin i believe and then those are the epsom um what else do we have these little catholic schoolgirl shoes some loafers oh these these are kind of fun oh oh she's on a night out she's going to a fancy dinner hello this Cartier has like a full bag range. They have all of the bags inside. Shall we have a look, possibly? Oh, who knew they even did? Well, this is ugly. Who knew they did these? Is that also not the best? These are cute. I think that these are very underrated as bags. Um, those two are the same size. And then you have the larger size here in the red, black, fuchsia and blush pink. You also have this range here. No idea what it's called. It looks very much like the jewellery box. And these, I actually really like these card holders. And I think that if you want like a fabulous card holder, you want something that looks, you know, fancy and all of that, but very understated, then I think these are very good out of interest. Let's see if we can find a price. 215 euros. I'm assuming that that is VAT free. There you go. And then they also do them in black and obviously the Cartier Red. Also, uh, pretty good selection of sunglasses here. These are actually quite fabulous. Oh, Cartier, you don't know what you're up to. Thin Ooh, arms there, all gold, very light. These are 1000 because they are most likely gold plated, probably. I don't know if I've just made that up. I hope you enjoyed that video. I tried to get as best as I could. There's quite a lot, just in general. The ranges here are quite classic, as in there's a less of the trendy pieces in a lot of places, a lot of like the tried and true, everybody loves the popular pieces are here, especially in like YSL, Louis, stuff like that. So there you go, hope you enjoyed it. There will be an unboxing to follow because I picked up something for my mum and just a little something for myself, just a small thing, a small thing. Nothing crazy, but you know, something nice. Um, 
I'm going to leave a link to another video here in case you haven't already seen it. And in the words of my father. If you like it, tell your friends. If you don't, keep your mouth shut. I will see you on my next video. Bye, guys.